guys i'm shakir ali today i'm gonna teach you how to create a simple store procedure for login this store procedure will be applicable in asp.net web forms and as, as well as when forms so let's start here i will use employees database click on table and click on new query so let's start First, we will create table users. ID data type will hint. This will be the primary key in ID. Second will be username. Then watcher. The size will be 50 and same for password. Select the code and execute it. Tables. Table is created successfully. So now we will create the store procedure. So let's start. create fork the procedure name will be sp login we will pass two parameters here one for username and one for password we will declare here one variable for status this will save the user status if user exists in the table or the database this will return one otherwise this will return zero So guys we are checking here if username and password is present in the table this will return 1 otherwise this will return 0 select status then select the code and execute it now refresh the programmability table navigate it there we go the store procedure is created successfully in next video tutorial i will show you how to implement this store procedure in asp.net web forms so please rate comment subscribe my channel and watch the next video thanks for watching